almost indecipherable if you don't speak the language. You can still play it, and I kind of understood what was happening, but the Japanese version of muff is not muff, so it's like, it was a waste of time. <laughs> like, you know, I was like, well, what's the fucking point if I can't hit muff? <laughs> like, <laughs> What's this shit anyway? This oh you, you can't have the lives. Um Yeah, so that was uh a thing. That was sure a thing. Spammy Muldoon over here. This isn't free. Let me... Uh, let me nothing! Go find a Zambi to slice. Okay, that was a waste of everybody's time, and I'm gonna go and die with my 12 health. lucky that was lucky so I screenshotted a few things from my uh, experiences on my Instagram uh, including from my Japanese my pure Japanese elitist experience of the original Metal Gear Solid game including that the health bar for Ocelot they have the name and they call it <laughs> it's literally written Ocelot with an R and I was like you telling me that that was like a is that a spelling mistake or is that how they spell his name in Japanese? I don't know how to handle that. Like Ocelot's an animal, and he's named after the animal. It should be well, fuck me, I guess. This guy is the biggest fucking problem. Fall to the up bar before it finishes as soon as you kill the sun. Okay. Well, yeah, I guess I knew that. So I killed everything except the big guy. Not what I wanted. Not what I wanted. <laughs> Fuck's sake. the wall. Clipping through the wall. Great. Yeah, so that, that was kind of funny, but the final boss fight of Metal Gear Solid 1 is fucking throw the controller, screaming at people, fuck everything. Bullshit. If you don't remember, or you didn't play it, play it, it's bullshit. <laughs> I'm get stuck on every fucking lip.
right, 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 right. Just not deal with him. Seems like the right answer. Oh, 20 armor, you're so kind. So, uh, yeah. Yeah, no, that final boss was just infuriating because it's essentially do all of this perfectly. Oh, you didn't do it perfectly? One hit. Or nearly one hit. And, like, sometimes you would, it was just, you're sitting there going, oh, <laughs> like, every five seconds because it's like, slide out from the place. You're basically reading the enemy's, uh, the giant mech, uh, its movement patterns, and doing your best to just. Sneak out, slowly lay down into a prone position, bring out your sniper rifle, hit him once. Okay, do it again. But now move, because it's going to do a missile barrage, and there's no way of, like... I couldn't work out the way of cheesing it so that it was, like, easier, you know? So yeah, I was following a walkthrough for that one, because so I was like, I don't get it, and I'm just trying to beat this game at that point. And I was like, following a walkthrough because it was in Japanese, and some of it's like, hey, me, and it's giving you tips, obviously, in that language, going, hey, maybe if you mine this wall, you picked up the C4, and I'm like, picking up little oblongs, just going, I don't know what the fuck this is, so I'm having to basically have a walkthrough next to me, so that I even have a vague idea what I'm expected. Same with Resident Evil 1 Director's Cut. I beat that game with all the text hard set into Japanese. It was very confusing because there's one level, there's one walk puzzle where you're supposed to put the, uh, you click the uh, paintings in order in the mansion. And it's like based off of age order, but the is such low res that you have to rely on the descriptions, and the descriptions were in Japanese. So I had to watch a video of the order, hoping they didn't remix it for Japan or the director's cut or something, and click the based off of what the guy was doing, because I was just like, I don't know, <laughs> like if what this says, <laughs> like you know. Voice acting, as standard though, was in English. So you could get most of what the plot was doing because Resident Evil's mostly voice acted. I'm just being followed around and tagged constantly. Fuck you. This dick. I'm gonna follow you around and punch you in the butt. Still low health because something hit me during that thing. And 
great at Marauder. Great, I missed. There you go. It's a bit finicky that. Mm, I need to use this. At least I got some armor for once. So I'm remembering to flame belch. That bite visual effect is such a uh, House of the Dead visual effect. Same as what used to pop up on the screen if you got bit by a zombie. Come on. This guy. I'm suddenly gonna have a massive health bar. drops you many, many floors for some reason. This level's long. It's fine, because I'm having fun, but like... The fuck? Oh yeah, that's... Again. Feels like this wasn't play tested. So you fall down through a hole and you can't get back up, and then an arc file spawns and can plink at you from beneath. So, what the fuck do I do now? <sighs> Why didn't they just fucking try and make it work? Like, even look at it twice would have been great. This shit right here, man. So I can stay down here infinitely, killing off these OP fuckers. Was I supposed to be able to fall through the world in certain areas, or is that not? Because so I can't find where I fell now. I fell off there. If I jump off, will it reset me in the right place? No. Wow. Yeah, okay. Fucking hell. Just fucking play test it more than once. Bethesda, everyone. Oh, that sounds like time when it could have been released. Oh my fucking god. Way to ruin the name of every franchise you ever get your hands on. Ah, 
Oh, I stayed still for a second, so I deserve to get my entire health bar wiped out. Fuck's sake. I was doing fine, and then I fell through the world and it just told me fuck you that's you totally your fault take the death wow if you're gonna do that if you're gonna seal this off like this seal off the outside as well because people are gonna do shit like that I was using the wrong gun. Now I'm walking slowly around, hitting everything very slowly with the shotgun and just going, uh. But I don't have any ammo in anything. I have one of everything. This shit again. So it auto locks me to the fucking. Ten rounds. They just stop dropping ammo after a while. Like, I mean, I've seen a few, but like, it's like, hey, are you using the shotgun? No, here's more shotgun shells then. Apparently I'm supposed to be using a shotgun. So one thing hit me, zero health. disappeared before I could get near it. Didn't realize it was there.
takes it a fucking hour to get over that one guardrail and it fucks me for health. Explosion just stopped there. You notice it didn't go off. Maybe it got bounced off. I don't know. That's a wide ass teleport range. Please enough is OP. Like it's fine, I think I could take him, it's just there's a lot of ads. <laughs> I'm just a bit like Haha. <laughs> but the ads are useful, so I was like run out of Okay, where's this asshole? Apparently wasn't fast enough, or he teleported away. Oh, it doesn't count, because he says so. He's taking his ball and going home. And literally again, he just teleported the fuck off somewhere. Oh, what? You hit me? No, you didn't, because I said you didn't. Well, there's several of them. Fuck you. Personally, that guy is just like, no. He's that one kid who's like, no, you didn't win. No. <laughs> He's just like, I hit you. Nah. I get, I get to still bring in these people. Fuck you. Come on, Pain Elemental. Really? Okay. This, this guy is just wandering around. He's just kind of floating about. He's not really doing anything. They're like, oh, you're going to get to Earth. The longer he's there, he's going to kill everyone. He's just walking around like, dum de dum <laughs> And you're like, oh. Where am I going? Where are we going? dum de dum I'm hungry. So, yeah, I played RE1 Director's Cut, and it was the Japanese version, and you can play that. 
roughly fine with no problems. Because, like, a lot of it's in, um, the voice acting's all in, uh, uh, English. So you don't miss out on any classic Barry. Am I just supposed to jump over there? It doesn't feel like I was supposed to do that. I fell down. I'm just hugely confused. Because there's no good jumping point from up here. Decided that part I wanted to grab. Starting to feel like the whole, hey guys, religion, kind of a tired thing, <laughs> like, you know, did you know religion can be used in a bad way to blind the stupid into doing really dumb things? It's a bit like, yeah, <laughs> like, you know, got loads of loads of examples both real life and in media that you know shit's kind of not great take this it did nothing what a waste of time oh there you are being a cunt again i see oh yeah i can trust space no one likes you And it's given me all the worst guns to fight you. And I played Ridge Racer on it as well because I had Ridge Racer, but you don't really need, like, for a racing game, you don't necessarily need the menus, obviously, a bit difficult to navigate in these things if you don't speak the language of the menu. But you kind of get it after a while because it's in the place where you would expect it to be, you know? And if not, you can always go back and forth. So I had Ridge Racer Type, type 4. But I was pretty disappointed with the uh, Mini, and most people are like, well, yo, the classic Mini sucks. It's like, well, I was playing it, I was getting it, because I was like, you know what, I'm going to sit here and I'm going to play Rayman. Because I never beat Rayman as a kid. And it had, like, a few other things. Twisted Metal, I always wanted to play. Siphon Filter, I always wanted to play. And it went, yo, fuck you. You don't have those. It had, um... What's that one that's like you pilot a Gundam but it's not a Gundam? Oh my brain. Not Siphon Filter. Um, it's really famous. It's a FromSoft. The FromSoft one where you have mechs. And my brain's going Twisted Metal. It's, like, it's not Twisted Metal. The one. The thing. It had that but it's... The controls are hard as is. The controls are even hard when it's like you will do the, this button does the Japanese thing.
interesting design, I guess. For those who don't remember because they didn't play the original Doom, oh, Icon of Sin. Destroy the armor pieces. Oh, great.